You're my lawyer, Rosenberg, not my interior decorator. Got it? What up, viewers? Brad Prider, Barstool Entertainment, returning to Vice City. I've been doing the Red Dead Redemption 2 videos four at a time, then interspersing with another video, and yeah, I missed a few videos with this Vice City because my capture device gave me a black screen playing certain missions, and I'm trying to figure that one out. But this one is called Shakedown, and it's after Tommy has taken over Diaz's criminal empire. And it's very simple. Tommy has to go and scare some um, vendors, people, into paying him for his protection. So let's get on with this mission shakedown. Oh, we gotta redecorate this place. We gotta make it look older. I can't stand this look. Tommy, what do you say? What do you say we put a bar in the... You're my lawyer, Rosenberg, not my interior decorator. Got it? Listen to me. The time to take over this town is now. It's all out there waiting for us. We need to start seizing territory and let Vice City know we're the new players in town. You know what I'm saying? What you need is a legitimate front, Tommy. Real estate. It's never done me no harm. We need to start using some muscle, or we can kiss all that hard work goodbye. Local business know Diaz is dead, and they're refusing to pay protection. Oh, we could try bribery. Bribery? Screw bribery. I'll show you how to make them scared. I'll be back here in five minutes. Well, now Tommy has to go to North Point Mall in Vice Point, and smash windows essentially so i'm going to fast forward to the mall you only have to smash a certain percentage of the windows i'm going to use a gun but then i switch to a shotgun because it's a little more effective Destroy Persetti, remember the name. Bye, bye, bye. That's all I like. Thank you. 
once you've smashed so many panes of glass, this comes up and it informs you that you can buy property on maps. And you see the greenhouse, you can buy that property. And yeah, that's all this mission does is it enables you to buy property. And the mission is easy enough to pass. Like I said, I used a shotgun rather than a baseball bat or a regular handgun. And you still are pursued by the cops, but it is what it is. I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. If you found this video informative, then hit the like button and leave a comment. Feel free to leave a comment. If you like this type of video, I post them uh, every couple of weeks or after four Red Dead Redemption 2 videos if I'm still on that whole uh, event. So hit the subscribe button and bell icon and you'll be informed when I post videos. As always, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and most of all, Thanks for stopping by.